Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about my favorite places to shop, where I get most of my clothing, and all of that fun stuff. So first I should talk about my style. Now my style has changed so much um, since last year. I honestly blame TikTok and Pinterest for that. But, I mean, I still have that girly vibe going on, but I would say as of right now, my style is a mix between princessy, girly, like soft, elegant, and preppy. So, one day I'll wear a pink, long, flowy dress, the next day I'll probably put on a blazer and some dress pants, and then for the weekend, I'm in a tennis skirt with a collared shirt. So I think that's a great combination for me, definitely my style. I guess I would like to thank 2020 for helping me find my style, but I'm still like discovering and trying out new things about my style every day. You know, what I'm comfortable in, what looks good on me, because it's just really hard to find clothing that actually fit me and that I actually like. Honestly, I can't really see myself just being one aesthetic for the rest of my life i i love change i really do love to like try new things and like really put myself out there and just like kind of step out of my comfort zone a little bit that's just my style now let's talk about places where i shop okay so first i'm gonna talk about tops and these are more like summery spring summery tops so i like to shop at forever 21 for tops and then i used to buy a lot of like pretty tops like this from shein but i don't really shop there as much anymore um but like these all of these are from shein they're like really cute little like summery tops and then i get like more like nicer ones from forever so like this one and then i have this one so cute and i have like another like bow tie top this one's from maybling and this one has like more like lace detailing which is like really cute so i really like this one they also have like amazing like sweaters and stuff on their site it's like a really cute little small business and i also have a discount code with them i will link it all in the description below so for like dresses i like to shop at charlotte ruse and forever 21 so like little simple like white dresses like this i get at forever and then this one from charlotte most of these stuff are like really old like i've got like years ago so they probably don't exist on the website anymore so i'm not really gonna like i'm gonna link as many available stuff as i can and i have this like beautiful pink satin dress honestly i <laughs> i only bought this for a tiktok video and i kind of ended up like really liking it for like springtime so yeah this pink is not really my color, but I think I pull it off very well. This pink is more like my color, and this one's from Forever 21. It's like this long, like a maxi dress with like this pleated bottom, which is like really cute. I absolutely love this. Moving on to bottoms, I have shorts, which I get from H&M, so like this one also have this one in black and i have like high-waisted like pants from charlotte ruse it's like really cute i also have this one in white and they're like very soft material they're not like jeans they're like that really nice material and they're very comfortable i don't find pants very comfortable so it's treasure for me when i find pants that are comfortable then we have my most worn white high-waisted pants from Maybling as well they're not on their website anymore i think it's like a discontinued 
um, item, but these are probably like the most comfortable pair of pants that I own. I love them because they're kind of, they're not like mom style, like mom jean style. They just looked really good. They're like streetwear style. I will insert some photos to show you how they look. And then I get all of my jeans from Hollister. These ones, this is definitely like a mom style jeans. They're like super baggy and I really like the bottom of them. So that's it for pants. Okay, so next is sweaters and I get almost all of my sweaters from Forever 21 because they just have like amazing quality sweaters. So a few that I got there, this is probably my favorite sweater. It's like, it's so comfortable. I sleep in this. I go out in stores in this. I get like all of my like turtlenecks from Forever as well. It has like that, this is like that fuzzy soft material. And then I have, I got this one. This is like a more thicker. It's not as soft as the other one, but it's oversized and I like it for the winter time. I used to buy a lot of my sweaters from Charlotte Ruse. So this is one of them. This is like a very old one. I used to wear this a lot in the winter time, like two years ago. This is like all that I would wear. And then I got a few other ones. So for blazers, I get them from H&M, Forever 21, and Boohoo. So in my last video, I showed you all this one from Boohoo. And then it's like my favorite blazer. This one from H&M. It also comes with like a pants, like the matching pants to it, which is like so amazing. And then this other one from Forever 21. So pretty. It's like a very pale peachy pink. Okay, so for skirts, so I get most of like my plaid skirts or like those like black plaid skirts from Shein because they have extra small sizes and that's like the only size that actually fit me so like this one and then i have this little blue one again i bought these for a tiktok video so next we have like my pleated tennis skirts this one i got from forever 21 and then my very iconic white one was gifted to me by blonde bear boutique and I will put their website down below as well. And for headbands, I get them mostly from Shein and Forever 21 because they have like really, really nice headbands. I can never find like really nice headbands anywhere. And even if I do, they're like over a hundred dollars. I kid you not, I have seen some sites that sell headbands, like fake silk headbands for like $50. What? No, they're just happy. Unless they're a designer, then yes. Go, go splurge your money, but no. So I haven't really bought like clothes, clothes that I would actually wear out in public and like go to places. So these are like old stuff that I bought when my style was whatever it was years ago. And now I'm just kind of like branching out and trying to find like different sites and stuff. So there are some sites that people don't shop at, they don't agree to shop at, and that's fine. I myself is trying to like step away from certain shops as well. So I do have a few shops in mind, so I am going to purchase stuff from them. Then maybe do like a review and see how I really like it, and then I'll let you guys know. So I think that concludes my video. I really hope this helps, and I hope if you guys are interested in princessy girly style, um, I hope you guys find some really nice pieces within those sites as well. If you found this video helpful and entertaining, um, don't forget to give me a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!